Alan Toussaint from New Orleans, a pianist, arranger, writer, uh, and I've spent, uh, I was born in New Orleans and I will live there all of my life. But I must say one of the pleasures has been coming to Amsterdam. This is my second time here and I love it dearly. Well, when I was a young man, I liked Professor Longhair very much. Uh, all of all piano players in New Orleans loved Professor Longhair in that time, and uh, Fats Domino. But uh, even aside from New Orleans, I, I like Ray Charles, and of course all of the great jazz pianists. I love Art Tatum, and uh, in fact, I think I like everybody. I've tried time and time again We end up, there's nothing but this There's a certain girl I've been after A long, long time In New Orleans, when I grew up uh, In my neighborhood, which was a very humble neighborhood I heard much blues then Because the, the old men, when they got off from work They would take the guitar and go sit on the porch and play And just about all of them played blues Blues, blues, blues uh, for one thing, they didn't have enough time in their lives to, away from their jobs, to develop anything uh, beyond that. Also, it's just where they came from and what they wanted to play. And I heard that all, the, all of the time. And sometimes, very late at night, we'd have characters who would uh, come home after they've gotten tanked up uh, in a joint. They would come walking down the street, blowing a harmonica, 12.30 at night on the way home and we'd hear that blues and some of the grown-ups of course would think that's ridiculous for them to be making that noise at night but those of us like myself we look forward to it it was a wonderful time uh, in the uh, middle 50s and even early, but middle 50s especially on into the 60s. Uh, Irma Thomas uh, and Benny Spellman, they were an Aaron Neville, and, and I would say uh, mostly 60s. Uh, yeah, late 50s into the early 60s. That's during the time of It's Raining and Rule of My Heart and things like that. Irma, uh, we had a group of people who would come to my parents' house where I live and they would spend the day, uh, Ernie Cato, Willie Harper, Aaron Neville, uh, sometime Chris Kenner, and Irma Thomas was the only girl with us. And I would write uh, one, one of the uh, singers there a song and everyone in the room would sing back up to it just to get started with it and then while they go and rehearse it further, the artists, I'd write another song for one of the other artists and everyone there would sing back up behind them. So on some early recordings of Reverend Aaron Neville, you might hear Irma Thomas way in the background because we were, that's the way we were doing it then. And we lived like that. Uh, uh, well, they'd come every day. Even I, they didn't live with me, but they came and we spent the day every day just about. We had a wonderful time. That was our way of life.
I really enjoy this trip being here. Uh, this and to see all the waterways, the canals, and all the bicycles, and it's just a wonderful place. And the, uh, the structures, the buildings, it's a fine place. And our audience was impeccable, just perfect. Uh, I I love Amsterdam. <laughs>